do I really want to be in a job which I really do not like for the rest of my life? I've worked in numerous jobs in the past from F&B to retail to events as a promoter and even as an admin in my 9 to 5 job. So when I was working in my office job, I was repeatedly scolded by my boss for making careless mistakes and also had to work OT over time for many hours that was unpaid for. So I just thought to myself, do I really want to be in a job which I really do not like for the rest of my life? And the answer is no. That's when I realized I wanted to do something more meaningful with my life. I also wanted to become financially free as I didn't want to feel obligated to work for someone else and I didn't want to feel stuck in a job that I didn't like for my entire life. So I had a vision for myself. I wanted to just relax by the beach, watch the sunset, listening to the waves and just don't have to worry about money. So I figured that there were only two ways to do to get to my lifestyle. It's either start a business or invest my money. And I chose the easy way around. I chose investing my money. So I would spend my free time learning how to invest. I would also spend my hard-earned savings investing in books, courses, and even pursue my degree in economics and finance. So while I was studying, I also wanted to learn something in the industry as well. And that was when I joined the financial services industry. Definitely the first few years was the toughest. I was working 10 hours a day and I was trying to juggle between school and work at the same time. I witnessed firsthand many of my friends and family members who suffered due to poor financial decisions. One of my relatives, he got into five figures worth of debt because he wasn't adequately insured when he got a heart attack. Another of my friend, he lost thousands of dollars through investments because he trusted the wrong person. I started to see many life stories like that and I felt that there were a lot of people who depended on me for help and that is why I felt I couldn't let them down. And that is also when I came up with this motto, educate, enlighten, and empower, to remind myself and others of my vision, which is to build a community of advisors who believe in educating, enlightening, and empowering the public to help them make a more informed decision for themselves. This was and still is one of the biggest reasons why I decided to commit to myself that I'm going to stay in this business for the long run, no matter how hard it gets, because I know that no challenge is too great if our purpose is bigger than ourselves. Now, if you don't know how to attract more clients and receive investment insights, I share more in my Telegram channels, which you can find them in the link below. So I'll see you guys soon and goodbye.